this is a barbaric disgraceful useless nonsense performance by the man united players plus the coach i don't even understand what kind of substitution he made why will you take holland out a guy that is the highest goal scorer for man united this season and he has not even scored in the premier league five goals in four why are you taking him out when you need to win a game and bringing in a player that has not even played full time in a long period of time why is Messi Mount coming in and you're playing with a first nine I really don't understand. Two quick goal at the dying minute, and Man United are seated bottom of that table. Now let's start with the first half. Good goal from Holland. Fantastic performance from Holland. He has to end his credit. Then everything went south. Harry Maguire gave out a penalty, a red card. You and I, you and I know that is a leg, leg breaker. That challenge from Rashford is a leg breaker. Whether he was, it was intentional or he, it, he wasn't looking, that is a leg breaker. That thing can make a player go out injured. And you're telling me that it was not intentional. Okay, the penalty awarded to Man United that made uh, Bruno Fernandes score his the third goal. Was it an intentional handball? They both went for the ball. That decision was harsh, but the rule is the rule. Rashford is one of the most experienced players when it comes to playing in the Champions League or in United. You don't make schoolboy errors when you are in a delicate situation like this. You are there for serious business. You, you cannot catch Saka going for his challenge and telling me he's not looking. So he should just be let go. No, 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 no. He can't be let go because that is a challenge. Rashford needs to man up. He needs to focus more and get his head back into the game. And that's no excuse. You get a red card, why lose your cool? We've seen teams that have gotten red card and managed to ensure they keep the scoreline, either change back to tactics or something. Players and coaches to take responsibility because there's no how you're telling me Compiègan we beat United. That's the biggest win in history. There's nothing you're telling me. Onana, what is Onana doing for crying out loud? Eleven goals in four games. Like I don't understand. Make it make sense to me. Eleven goals in four games. Are you a basket? Are you a basket? I don't understand. Are you a basket to make save? That's why David Ayer is there. Eric Tehan will have to man up and get this team working because right now I don't understand the performance from Man United. And nobody can blame um, Bruno Fernandes. He's trying his best. There's nothing this guy can do. He's the captain of the team. If rescued Man United scoring the winning goal against Burnley, against Forest, against Fulham, even though it's a penalty, and again he scored a penalty before United went to concede again. It's a disgraceful, useless, embarrassing performance from Man United, both the players and the coach.